Hey everybody, it's The Walker. So what do we got planned today? Oh, uh, we're going to show you a $20 titanium fry pan. There's a little bit of story on this. Uh, years ago, maybe 10 years ago, I got a ever new, I believe it's ever new titanium fry pan. Oh man, I was happy. And then one day last year, it just disappeared. I have no clue where, I don't know where it went to. I already had a cook set, so all I really needed was just the, um, just a fry pan. So I looked online and I actually found one for $20. And we'll show in action. Uh, of course, it's a crappy day today in the woods. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna set up camp, probably gonna stay the night in a spot, and we're gonna squirrel ourselves up a meal. All right, stay tuned. We'll get some of those. Yeah. There we go. Hey everybody. Well, we're on the move. Um, take a look at this. Good. Here's a flower. Excellent, excellent. Those are um, wild violets. Actually, aren't all violets wild? Pretty steep ground. There we are. Wouldn't take too much to go right off. So I'll be careful with that. Yeah, I don't want to fall down that. There we go. You know it's raining and kind of crappy out. It's pretty nice. Signs of spring. You know? Actually into May, so they ought to be signs of spring. Find yourself a spot. I want to keep a little higher. Supposed to rain throughout the night, so I want to keep a little. I want some distance from that river a little bit. I mean, it doesn't look like it's going to flood out, wipe out the entire place, but a little slight bit more elevation might be kind of nice, you know. We're all set up. Let me show you the camp. There you go. I was going to do a different pitch, but then I remembered I had the Gore-Tex Bivy. And you can see it, the old... Gore-Tex Bivy sleeping bag. So if my legs should flail over um, outside of the tarp, so what? It's Gore-Tex, you know? I'll show you that frying pan in a second. Now, I was gonna go fishing, but the um, river's hopelessly flooded, so we'll go down, we'll take a look at that. Fortunately, I bought a contingency plan. Although we do have some wild edibles, so, you know, that's a positive. But, I, we're not getting any trout today. See here. Here's the river. That's just flooded. I mean, there's no doubt that is flooded. There's no way. There's just no way. I mean, um, oh. 
Hold on. Oh man, what's this? Somebody had a rough winter. A real rough. Look at those teeth. Oh wow, look at that. Look at that. Oh, and there's a leaf in its eye. Oh man. There's a leaf in its eye. Oh, and its skull too. What is this? You know. You know what I'm thinking? Chipucabra! We got a chipucabra! Man! Oh man, we got a chipucabra! Ah! Ah! Chipucabra! Man, we have a chipucabra! No, one, no one's gonna believe this. No one's gonna believe this at all. A chipucabra! All right, here, let's put this chipucabra back. Look at that. Her chipucabra. That's cool. All right, we'll put that back. Well, yeah, clean up. <laughs> we're gonna cook pretty soon. I'll be messing with the chipucabra skull. Okay, so we're not getting any trout. Let's set that frying pan, and I'll give you the whoop, and I'll give you the lowdown on that. Chipucabra. So what did we squirrel up in the woods? Okay, we have a wild pig that I killed with uh, wild scallions. No, actually that was bacon. I brought that in case I couldn't catch any trout and guess what, I couldn't catch any trout. Here we have um, the hemlock, which is the uh, Kernifer evergreen, not the toxic killer, uh, kill you dead weed. Some partridge berries. And over here we have the dandelions. Now I think people have already figured out where I'm going with this. I'm gonna fry the dandelions and the onions in bacon grease. That is the general plan. We'll set it up and then we'll talk about the um, actual fry pan, the $20 fry pan. The $20 Tokes fry pan. Uh, years ago, I had a fry pan from a company called, I believe, Evernew. It's like literally 10 years ago. I had it, I used it for year after year after year. It was great, then one day, it just ran away in the woods. I have no idea. I mean, I'm pissed. It's gone. I, don't, I still can't find it. I still can't find it. I don't know where it is. So I didn't need a whole nother mess kit, but I wanted a fry pan um, because I have, this is the um, MSR Titan titanium kettle, snow peak little cup. Well, get back in there. These are great items. These are really good items. And of course, Cheap little spoon, cheap little spatula. Hey, it's great. But my pan was gone. I had no fry pan. And I like to kind of like put it all together. So Tokes, they, had a, they, had a, they have a kit, a mess kit. I believe it is, I even brought a piece of paper so I don't get this wrong. It's their six, actually 1600 milliliter pot pan. I don't need, I didn't need the pot. I just want the pan because the pan, look at that becomes a little fry pan on top of being a lid. Now, as you can tell, this one's been used a lot. I, 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 this is, I forgot. It's at least over a year, maybe two years. So I've used the heck out of this. So it's all charred up and everything. It's, it's doing great. The only real slight minuscule problem I've had is the little, uh, I guess I'll call these the silicone, um, little grabby insulator things. They got slightly charred in a fire, but that's it. Who cares? I mean, it has no effect on anything. And then you know, look at that. Perfect. Oh, so it's a great little fry pan. It's um, literally, I think two and a half ounces. Now, if you want to get it, this is what I did. I went to Tokes Outdoors. Then you go down to their accessories. It says accessories. Then it says pan and the model is pan dash 145. Got a piece of paper so I don't get this wrong. I'll also put it up on the screen. And you too can, and it's $20. You can have yourself, look at that, a $20 titanium fry pan. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna start cooking up this um, fine food. We'll readjust that. And we're gonna move on that part. All right, I guess it's time to cook the food. There we go. Not bad, did a good job. Okay. Whoa, whoa, 
throttle you back a little bit. Throttle, 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 throttle you back, throttle you back. There we go. Ah, much better, much better. Where's the first bacon? Our bacon with dandelions. What do we got here? Bacon's awesome. Also, don't forget the scallions. Man, that's <laughs> good. I think I, I don't have to be barbaric about this. I have a spoon. All right, so here's the scallions, and oh, that's a little scallion and dandelion. Excellent. Excellent. Damn. You look there. Bacony, scalliony goodness. Whole scoop full of bacon fried dandelion. That's excellent. You know the greens actually? The greens are actually, I mean, Bacon rocks. I mean, bacon is absolutely fantastic. But these greens are really making this whole thing even better. Um, so, and as you can see, the $20 fry pan, I mean, at 2.5 ounces, I haven't bought another fry pan after that. I was like, what's the point? What am I gonna spend? I, I forgot how much I ever knew it was. God, it was like 60 bucks, maybe more. I'll, I'll put the price up for that. How's that outrageous. I think it's just fine. I mean, okay, granted, it's not as good as cast iron, but I don't want to be carrying cast iron. Oh, let's try this up little. There's a little, um, little scallion. Nice. They're nice when they're young like that. Okay. It's always good. I really like that. Okay, everybody. Um, that's it for today. And um, consider, you know, one of the best 20 bucks I spent. So $20 titanium fry pan. And as always, uh, thank you very much for looking and have a really good time.